Okay. What's going on? You already know what it is. It's your boy Samad Savage. It's good with it. I'll give you so much more. Now I just ordered the actual analog version of this. I've seen yeah, you've seen this somewhere. Now let's just crush that shit. Now y'all going about top five. Who was your top five? My top five is um, it starts with Lupe Fiasco because he has lyricism, flow, um, consistency, um, complexity. Like he has so many things on top of each other. Now Eminem has all of these things too, but I feel like as far as concepts goes and sticking to concepts, Lupe Fiasco took it to another level, and that's what put him ahead of Eminem more so. And about like I think that was like maybe whenever whenever um. Uh, Tetsuo and Youth dropped. That's when I made that decision because I was like, yo, I've listened to Eminem for years and years and years and I still love him and I still think he's dope to this day. But when Lupe dropped that, I was like, yo, I had to take a look back at all of his discography and I was just like, yo, nah, there's, there's no way this isn't my favorite rapper. Lupe, number one, uh, uh, Eminem, number two. And the last three always switch around like it's not like in any particular order but um a uh, big pun common okay now people don't even understand how much common influences me no, I, I understand common because every album common put out I, I... he's never put out a, a, a truly whack album even that one that we all thinking about that was not that good yeah even that one that wasn't that good like still has some crazy like like he still wrapped his behind off it's just the beats was different but um yeah common and uh big daddy king but what's your intro music because that's a real unique top i've never heard that top five and I've never heard anybody break down the criteria because my my thing was always the top five. I always wonder what was the criteria. Mm. You know what I mean? Like Joe is the greatest. Like what's the criteria? Mm. So I always wonder, and, and I never really heard anybody break down what the criteria was. Like you did. How old are you? I'm um, 23. 23. So I was a little bit older. I thought he was younger. So now what's your, <laughs> what's, your what's your intro to music? Like, how, what, what, you, what did you come up listening to? Like, what, like did, you, did your parents? I kind of know that. I kind of know the answer. That's what's funny. So what, what, what's your intro to music? My, all I can say is like my mom always listened to radio, like whether it be High ninety seven or Power Power one hundred five. Like I, I pretty much grew up on that. But what I remember is when I was in my grandma's car, I was listening to a lot of uh, Tupac, and when I'm in my grandfather's car. I'm listening to Eminem and DMX, which is so ironic because those are the only two rappers he listened to. Other than that, he only listened to country. <laughs> I, I would say as far as MOP goes, I, I don't remember my mom actually buying any of the albums or anything like that, so I didn't hear from her. But my father, biggest MOP fan that I know, maybe other than you now. <laughs> and he um he had a uh, he actually is is friends with a uh, uh, Billy Dance. Nice. Yeah, nice. yeah. He uh, they 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 somewhere up in the Poconos and whatnot. Like they heard my music and whatnot. Nice. And they heard it when it wasn't as good as it is now, which I always regret when my you know favorites hear it and it's like not where it could have been. But it's it's nice to know that he got to meet his 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 uh, biggest inspiration. Right. And he was cool to him. Yeah. But I I want to give him my top five. I don't want to see his reaction. Absolutely. Cause this is this is just out of curiosity, and this is no particular order, but it's Karis one, Trash. Ghostface, Trash. Red Man. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> we, nah. can, we, we can turn the camera off, turn it back on, and then we can really go. I'm nah, say, that's Bible. He said track. Karis. Nah, track. nah, I'm joking. I, nah, nah, Karis one is is uh, probably in my top fifteen. I hit all day, Red Man all day, every day. Oh yes, 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 yes. My favorite MC though is Ghostface Killer. That. Is an absolutely amazing MC to choose. I think if I was a little bit a little bit older, he would have been in my top five. 